If we look at Satoshi's white paper from October 31st, 2008, he really lays out two purposes to what the mining is. And it's actually the central innovation of Bitcoin is the proof of work mining. The rest of it is already known concepts. So the first purpose is to provide a temporal ordering of transactions to provide transaction finality. So you can think of Bitcoin mining like a decentralized clock that ticks every 10 minutes and that is calibrated from the outside by Bitcoin nodes. So Bitcoin nodes are verifying the blocks being proposed by Bitcoin miners, checks and balances, and Bitcoin nodes are very efficient and cheap to run, so you can run it on your laptop or on your desktop. And that the second purpose of Bitcoin mining is introducing new units of BTC onto the ledger. And that issuance schedule is set by the nodes. So the nodes verify that the miners are not just creating more Bitcoin than they're allowed to per the consensus rules. And that quantity actually gets cut in half every four years so that asymptotically the total Bitcoin supply will cap out at 21 million Bitcoin. Already today, 95% of the Bitcoin have been mined. When you think about it from the dilution of an asset perspective, uh, Bitcoin has achieved the status of being the hardest money in the world. And that's, I think, what has been driving its market cap to $2 trillion now.